Good morning and welcome to Life Kids. We are so excited that you could join us this morning, aren't we, Avi? Yeah. You ready? Uh -huh. So this week is our final week for Operation Christmas Child. We're going to be wrapping it up with a really cool uh, video in a few seconds. But we're going to start off with a word of prayer, and Amy's going to uh, kick us off with a beautiful prayer. Go ahead, Amy. Dear God, thank you for this day. Thank you for my family and friends, and thank you for all the wonderful things we have. Amen. Amen. That was beautiful, Amy. Good job. Okay, so boys and girls, it's that time where we're going to sing some uh, really amazing songs. And this week is going to be some more Christmas songs. So Yay. boys and girls, stand up. Sing along. Moms and dads, feel free to join in too. Enjoy.
Yes, we love the snow, don't we? Yeah. Okay. Uh, and I like this kind of snow because it has very little cleanup, right? <laughs> Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we're going to jump right into our video this week. It's about a little boy named Terry, right? Do you remember how old he was? He was seven. He was seven years old when this video was done, right? Yeah. So, enjoy. My name is Terry and I'm seven years old. I live in Arandes. Arandes is in Namibia. My favorite things to do is sing and play and read. I live with my N sister, needle brother, big sister, and big sister. My grandmother, she teach me how to read a Bible all by myself and told me how to play, close your eyes, and talk to God. When she passed away, I feel very sad. My grandmother was very kind and like just like an angel. We used to play, sing, and read every day. The Bible I used before was my grandmother. My grandmother's Bible used to make me happy. That's why I pray for my own Bible to have. I was alone in my room. I sit on my knees and I talk to God. God, I need a Bible. A week later, God sent for me a gift. Jesus loves you, my friend. Jesus loves you. The shoe box I got was very special. I feel like Jesus was giving it to me. I was very excited, but I was shy. Getting a gift was very new for me. Opening the book, I did find toys, cars, and a Bible. When I saw God answer my prayer and I see it, I ran home excited. I couldn't wait to, to play and read and pray. God answered my prayer and I felt so happy. The person who packs my book, I like to say thank you and I like to say, my God bless you. Wasn't that a great video? Yeah. Okay, so this little boy, his name was Terry, he was seven years old, okay, and um, he loved his grandmother very much, right? Yeah. And he was raised with his brothers and sisters. He lives with them. And then um, his grandmother taught him how to read what? Do you remember? The Bible. The Bible. And so he read her Bible. Um, but then the grandmother had passed away, and um, he wanted his own Bible, didn't he? The grandmother also taught him how to what? Pray. How to pray. And praying to God is very simple, isn't it? What do we do? Um, we close our eyes and bow our heads. Okay, that's one way of, of praying, yeah. And and then what do you do? You talk to who? God. Um, you just talk to him, right? Um, sometimes you just tell him things. Sometimes you, you ask for things. But you just talk to God. And it's very easy to pray, isn't it? And we like to pray, don't we? Uh-huh. So in this, in this story, he prayed for a Bible, right? And then um, Operation Christmas Child Boxes were delivered to his village, right? And they were all handed out. And he received in his package what? Do you remember? A Bible. A Bible. Now, did God answer his prayer? Yes. He did, didn't he? Because Terry was praying for a Bible. Then Operation Christmas Boxes show up a little while later. And inside his box was a Bible. Now, do you think the person that was packing his box knew that Terry, the seven-year-old boy, in a different country, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of miles away, wanted a Bible? No. No. Right? They just packed the box the way that God wanted them to pack the box, and then God was able to get the box to them. Was he excited to have a Bible? Yes. And do you think he read his Bible? Yes. Should we read our Bibles? Yeah. Yeah, we should read them daily, shouldn't we? Yeah. Yeah, it's really good to, to be in God's Word, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, awesome. So with all of that being said, packing Operation Christmas Child Boxes is something fun to do, but it's also something um, amazing to do and be used by God to help others and other children in other countries, right? Okay, so we're, we're finishing up this week for Operation Christmas Child. Um, continue to do your letters and your cards. If you would like to decorate the inside of boxes, they're going to be delivered hopefully sometime this week. They're a little behind. Um, so hopefully they'll get delivered this week and just email me at lifekids at lifechurchcalvert.com. 
um, and we can we can meet up and I can get you a case of boxes to decorate the insides, right? Yeah. Okay, awesome. Continue to collect your items because November will be here before you know it. August is almost done. We're rolling into September. So Christmas is like 119 days away, give or take. Um, so we're excited. Uh, we're looking forward to being all back together and being able to do this as a ministry together, correct? Correct. Okay, so let's close out in a word of prayer. Are you ready? Yeah. Dear God, we thank you for today, Lord. I thank you for each child that's here and each family that's represented, Lord. I just pray a, pray a special blessing over all of them, Lord God. I pray um, just starting out now, even just in August, Lord, um, I pray for these boxes that we will create uh, throughout the coming months, Lord, for, for the boxes to go to the right children, Lord, and for the children that are receiving them, Lord, that they receive not only just a simple gift or a toy or an outfit, Lord, but that they receive salvation in you, Lord. We thank you. We praise you in your holy and blessed and wonderful name. Amen. Amen. Okay. So what's left? Song. We have a couple more songs, right? So stand up. Boys and girls, sing along. Moms, dads, feel free to join in too. Okay, have a great week, guys. Bye. Bye.